Same setup. Start with. Are you doing what is title? Hi, I'm Jerry Neal. I'm the current Sounders FC fan of the year. And uh, I've been a fan of soccer. Well, off and on, I played when I was in kindergarten uh, for the Totem Bulldogs on the really horrible clay dirt field in Fedra Way. And uh, even, even to that, this day, I had no clue what I was doing back then. But, you know, as a kid playing soccer, it's, oh, you're just out there having fun. And it wasn't until after high school when I went off to various other sports, coaching basketball, doing track and cross country. And then all of a sudden uh, I'm at work one day and there was an ad for the Seattle Sounders. And I'm like, whoa, this, this, this seems kind of interesting. Check it out. And it wasn't until oh nine mid through oh nine uh that i just happened to wander down pioneer square by fuel and uh got invited in and got a ticket to uh game versus san jose and that was my first real uh taste of american soccer now and not even getting halfway through the tunnel uh of the main concourse out to the section i'm like okay this is going to be good and and sure enough it hasn't disappointed since and shortly after the end of 09 i got my first ever season tickets to any sports team and i've been there ever since the alligator story what was it two years ago uh apparently merit polson the owner of the timbers once a year goes to some trip excursion and he went to somewhere in florida the best we can understand and there were baby alligators and apparently he decided uh while he was holding the baby alligator to put his hand near the alligator's mouth yeah it's a baby it looks really innocent but then two days later uh we find out that he posted a photo to his instagram of his mangled middle finger that got bit by the baby alligator because when you're a uh, owner of a sports team you definitely want to post how stupid you are on your social media page and so a whole bunch of us screen crapped it and we still have that <laughs> hilarious photo and so we're at it, it, shoot to like three four months later we're at fuel out front and rob scott and i are sitting out front bsing talking about the random sounder, whatever sounder thing came to mind and trying to decide a TIFO display for Portland talking about, oh, we're gonna do this water made out of car, dis car display water and we're gonna get inflatable goldfish. Well, I'm like, oh, that's, that, that, that'll, that'll be really funny because it came around when Will Johnson decided to post game interview and say, oh, our team have heart of lions, but brains of goldfish good captain and so one day I'm like I was looking online on Amazon and they had these alligator inflatable alligators which I thought were gonna be a little bit smaller than it ended up being that was gonna be like a three foot ended up being a five six foot long inflatable alligator that you can use for your swimming pool and we had actually had two Portland games one away or one one home and one in the Open Cup and I had the, I ordered the alligator, got here in time, but I chickened out two game, two Portland games in a row because I wasn't sure if it, it, it'd be able to make it in or not. And so finally we got to a Portland, the last Portland away game, and I'm just like, oh, screw it, I'll bring it anyway. And I just brought it in draped, draped, as, draped as a scarf around me, and they didn't even, they didn't even ask. They just figured it was normal, so we're in the stadium and it took like eight of us to inflate this alligator before the game. And then all of a sudden it was Oba's first goal. And it's on ESPN. So you have Alexi Lawless and John Strong, whatever, commentating. So they, they, go, they show Oba scoring this goal and they pan to a faraway shot from our section. 
and I'm just fist pumping the alligator in the background, but they're not sure what exactly this thing is. And so they go back to Oba close up. And then in the meantime, they're doing like a super close up of me. And, and then you see all, you kind of hear Alexi in the background, just laughing because he totally gets what, what the reference is to. And, uh, after that, it of course became a legendary gift on Twitter, gif on Twitter. And, uh, it only made it to one other game since then. And that was, a. Uh, that was our home game this last year, uh, which it barely made it in there as well. But he sh perished shortly after that game, so he's been retired. And so that was that was why the alligator came to be to make fun of Merritt. <laughs>